On ABC 15 tonight, a family man finding out the hard way just how to get banned from Walmart for life. ABC 15's Stephanie Hockridge is live at our newsroom right now. And, uh, Steph, how did this happen? Well, uh, Steve, Joe Cantrell goes through ads just like these every single week, trying to find the biggest discounts. And then he goes to the Walmart in Santan Valley. And uh, we're going to show you up here on our screen. Uh, this is Walmart's ad match guarantee. They says they will gladly match the price in certain items. But... When he tried to add match last week, Joe says the unthinkable happened. I'll break it! What? what started as a simple trip to Walmart to get Christmas ornaments for his family's tree turned into the biggest nightmare of Joe Cantrell's life. I was handcuffed and humiliated and embarrassed in front of everybody. And Joe just may be the most loyal Walmart shopper you've ever met. At least twice a day. Uh, once in the morning with my grandmother. And then again in the evening. I just, I love Walmart and that's why I go. Because to Joe, every little dollar counts. I'm sorry, I get a little... Emotional about this. It's, it's just, it's hard because I'm disabled. After eight years in the ring as a professional wrestler and lots of injuries, I can't do what I used to do for a living anymore. So, four months ago, he started ad matching. But last week, when a Walmart employee told him it wasn't allowed, Joe complained to management. So, when I left, he turned around and called Pinal County Sheriff, said he felt intimidated and threatened. I was upset, but never once did I ever say anything. No contact, nothing. Four days later, when Joe went back to Walmart, he says three deputies cuffed him, gave him this court summons, and a notice banning him from any Walmart in the world for life. I felt shamed, and I felt like I was a bad guy, and I know that I'm not a bad guy. And so did the deputies. Joe says when they realized the nature of the complaint, they let him go. They saw a grown man cry like a baby, probably because I knew I was going to go home to my family. Let's show them the Christmas tree. Oh, and then I'd be able to fix, finish that tree. Yeah. Yeah. So Joe was not arrested, but he still has to go to court to face those charges against him. He doesn't have an attorney. And of course, he's still banned from Walmart for life. We contacted Walmart. They did not respond to our request for a response. And Steve Joe says if he ever knew that ad matching was going to cost something like this, he never would have done it. You know, lots of customers have disputes here. Mm -hmm. There are cameras, too, that. There probably are. caught some of this? Yes, there are. He's going to request that footage. He's still waiting for, uh, for that. Uh, Walmart says that, you know, they haven't, they haven't responded to us, and Joe says he hasn't even heard from them yet, so we'll keep you posted on what yeah. we learn. We'll see how it plays out. Thanks, Steph.